Wondering what our local real estate market is like right now? Our price is going higher. Is there still demand to purchase a home? Hi neighbors, Catherine Newman, real estate agent with Allison James, and today I'm going to answer these questions and more. So stay tuned for this Manatee and Sarasota County real estate market update. According to data from Florida Realtors and compiled by the Realtor Association of Sarasota and Manatee, the July 2021 market stays on trend with rising prices and decreasing inventory. Quoting our local association president, Alex Crum, the real estate market is as hot as it's ever been. The demand for homes is so high that we're selling homes as quickly as they come available. Almost every home you see for sale this week won't be available next week. In Manatee County, the closed sales for the month of July 2021 decreased 5.8% over this time last year. And for condos, closed sales decreased 6.5%. Also in Manatee County, the median price for single family homes breaks yet another record high price this year at $430,000 in July 2021, an increase of 19.8% and an average of six days until under contract and only a 0.8 months worth of inventory. For condos, July 2021 saw a 13.7% increase to $250.50, also with an average of six days under contract, a slim 0.6 months worth of inventory. That's less than a month's worth of available homes for sale, y'all. RASM President Alex Crum states, interest rates are still playing a big role in the home buying frenzy here as well as the desire to live and invest in Sarasota and Manatee counties. For Sarasota County, the July 2021 stats show that closed sales decreased by 9.8% for single family and 3.8% for condos. The single family home price in Sarasota was 400,000 in July a 22.2% increase from last year and only five days to contract and a 0.8 months worth of inventory. In the condo market, Sarasota reported a 31.3% increase to 315,000, six days to contract and a 0.6 months worth of inventory. More from RASM president, the incredible price increases we've seen are forecast to subside, but not recede over the next year. Those who want to purchase in the next few years are wise to purchase now. There is no imminent correction coming. It is entirely likely that we're seeing a permanent correction upward as Florida home prices, which are historically in the middle of the road nationally, trend toward the values of the states from which our buyers are migrating. Combined for both counties, new pending sales decreased by 25.4% for single family homes and by 22.3% for condos. Newly listed homes totaled between the two counties grew year over year by 3% for single family homes and decreased by 15.5% for condos. The inventory of all property types in the two counties decreased year over year by 65.7% to 1,771 active listings at the end of July. Inventory is up slightly from last month, but that might be a one-time coincidence, not a trend, said Crum. Late summer is always a slower time for real estate sales in Florida. Regardless, we're a long, long way from a balanced market. If you'd like to know the value of your current home in today's hot market, give me a call or send me an email and let's discuss your home's value proposition in this low inventory scenario. I'm Katherine Newman. Thanks for checking out checking in for this Manatee and Sarasota County real estate 
market update.